When you meditate, you meditate, you need a good foundation. <coughs> you need to establish your foundation as solidly and as quickly as you can. Because when you sit down to meditate, sometimes the problems come up in the body, problems come up in the mind. Problems in the body or the pains here and there, problems in the mind or thoughts that go off in all directions. You need a good foundation if you're going to fight with them. It's like being a Thai boxer. A Thai boxer needs a good, solid place to stand in order for him to kick the opponent, in order to be able to fight. But if the, if the floor he's standing on is moving around all the time, he's going to fall down. It's the same way with the mind. If our mind is moving around all the time, then as soon as it runs into pain, it's going to fall down. It's going to lose its balance, lose its poise. And we'll be able to deal with it properly. Because dealing with things like pain and distraction requires some careful attention. They require that you see things clearly, see what's going on in the mind, to see what exactly in the mind is causing the problem. Because the pain in the body, of course, is not really the problem. It's what the mind does with it. That's the problem. The same with your thoughts. A thought can come and go and not cause any problem, but it's what you do with it that creates problems. So you've got to watch yourself carefully. And to see yourself carefully, the mind has to be well-founded, well-grounded. Well so try to be grounded in the breath. Make sure the breath is comfortable, it comes in, is comfortable, it goes out, it's comfortable. If it's not comfortable, you can change. And what was comfortable yesterday may not be comfortable today, so you have to keep on top of the needs of the body and the mind right now. And that way you've got a good foundation. Anything comes up, okay, you're well-founded, well well-grounded. And from that position of being well-grounded, then you can deal with things effectively. So make sure that you don't run away from your foundation here. And keep your foundation as strong as you can. So when pains come, distractions come, they don't overwhelm the mind. The mind can overcome them. And then what do you have to fear? Those are the big problems in the present moment. We're driven around by our pains our fear of pains. But when you learn that you can deal with pain without any fear, then what are they, what are they going to use to drive you around? This is one of the ways in which the mind gets free. <laughs>